Well, you'd think I'd learn, after the amount of times I've sharpened my saw, to wear gloves. But I clearly haven't learned that. Well, I have, but I don't seem to really care. Guys, I get cut every time I do tree work, so... Might as well talk about this real quick. So today, this project, this big boy, the top is busted out of it. I don't know if you can see. Right there, it's hung up. And the top of that real long apple tree. And yeah. So plan is to, I think I'm just going to drop it and slam it down here, or with a rope in it, and 5 to 1 and all that, or I might just spur up this thing and clean it all off so it's just a big spur. So I got all the bullshit off of that thing. It's just a sparrow with one big ugly limb up top. And I got it roped off. Going down to the cedar down there. And I'm gonna create a five to one. I probably don't need it all that much, but since I'm kind of by myself, I'm just gonna cut my notch, leave the holding wood with a wedge, and then uh, rope it over with a five to one. Yeah, I'll get that set up now. And I could have taken the time to put some progress capture on here, but I did not. I like to make things hard for myself, it seems. That's a good way to learn lessons, though.
Okay, so we need to pull it. Shouldn't be too hard. Hopefully. It's fun when you get yourself in these situations. You really got a giver. Okay, here we go. Here she comes. Nice log. Yeah. 